Hey guys, it's Diane from Diane Hawkman, and today I want to talk to you about edification. Edification! You need to learn to edify! What the heck is edification? Listen, in the home business industry, in network marketing, it is critical, critical, critical that you learn how to speak appropriately about your upline, your sideline, and your colleagues. Okay? All pros know how to do this. All newbies, all, you know, amateurs don't. Okay? What we're doing is we're referring to and pointing to people that are, you know, involved in business. So with us now, let me let me slow down because my my mind is racing. I want you to get this, and uh, I need to settle myself down here. Um, here's a great example. I work with a gentleman named Ray Higdon, okay, and Ray is my upline at my particular opportunity. So when I talk about Ray, I always edify him. So, for example, if I were introducing you, I go, you know, I really want you to meet Ray. Um, not only is this guy the number one earner at our company, but he also just has a vast, vast business background. The guy knows about speaking, selling, marketing, online, offline. I mean, he's the real deal. Okay. That's an edification. It's not a suck up. I'm not going, I love Ray. He's so smart. He's so incredible. That's what a lot of people do. Okay. Edifying is just pointing out the attributes that this guy has to the person that's going to meet him. And the real focus is to get the new person that's meeting him to feel he has credibility and that he can help. So you can edify anybody. It might be a brand new person. I just met them, and I might go, hey, guys, I want you to meet Sally. She's new. Uh, what I love about Sally is, you know, obviously she's been holding down a full time. She's got five kids. So this girl's got it going on. She's been juggling everything and keeping it together. I know she's going to be a big asset to the team. That's edifying, okay? Now, there's a huge difference between edifying and being a fan of. And it's really important for your business that you don't run around being the fan of, in quotes, whoever. You know, let's take Mike Dillard, for example, the, you know, probably one of the biggest guys in, in our sector of the industry, uh, if not the biggest, you know, and I know Mike. And when I talk about Mike, you know, he's made millions and he's done all this stuff, but I don't coo about it. I'm just like, guys, you know, I want you to, you know, go check out Mike Dillard. He's the author of Magnetic Sponsoring. This guy has just done crazy stuff in this industry, and the book is like the, uh, you know, the Bible of attraction marketing. So definitely go read it. That's an edification. So what I want you to do is practice one noticing the pros at your company and how they edify and introduce one another. And then I want you to practice doing it. You know, even grab a couple of your team members and just practice amongst yourselves because this is something that you want to get real good at. And it's one of the reasons, too, I'll, I'll, I'll dare say that, you know, I've climbed up the ranks um, in our sector of the industry and I've really built great relationships. And part of the reason why is because I edified uh, everybody, um, you know, that that I was talking to, uh, to other people. So people come to know that, you know, I do that. And then the last thing is um, I always love to edify those that I learned from, whether I learned a little or a lot. I always like to, you know, if I if I quote someone, I always say who the quote came from. Uh, if I talk about where I learned something, I'm always going to edify. Um, I use Randy Gage as an example a lot. You know, Randy was the first guy. If you don't know Randy Gage, it's um, randygagestuff.com. Randy was the first guy to turn me on to prosperity thinking. Um, and he's a brilliant man, a brilliant marketer, um, and he brought to the industry things that we really needed. I had to change everything about the way I thought, and it was Randy that uh, turned me on to all this stuff. So thank you, Randy. Guys, that was an edification, okay? So that's it. Hopefully you understand this. If you have questions, definitely leave me a comment, as you always can. And if you'd like more training, definitely head over to DianeHockman.com. Maybe you're seeing this on the blog, or maybe you're catching it on YouTube or on the podcast. It's DianeHockman, H-O-C-H-M-A-N.com. Um, definitely get on my list so I can send you out training and help and all kinds of good stuff and products and services that might uh, give you a hand in your business. And I'm looking forward to seeing you at the top. We'll see you guys later.